So the one that you should use is the Media in versus loader. Which one should you use? Welcome back to a new episode here in Swalvi. In today's episode, we're gonna dive into which one should you use when you're making a fusion composition and you're working in with like an image or a media in file that you put inside your project that you're working on, right? So the first thing we're gonna do here, I'm gonna show you right here you can see these like little this composition i made so just to show you this as an example so in this one there's a media in right here that is what we are using which is where we drag this image file right here that we have the loader node allows you to find in a specific image or file in the pathway here that you can then use to actually find whatever you need right so it sort of like takes it directly from your computer. So we're going to add that node and we're going to use that as the same image, but we're going to use this path. And the only difference is that one of them is coming from the media file folder here. And the other one is coming directly from your computer. So if we go to another project, for example, let me just open the second project in which I have copied the so if we go to a second project and I use the power beans to drag that same fusion composition that we have in the other project and I drag it right here, you will see the same one is here and I drag it on our timeline and you will see here it shows the media offline, right? And that is because we don't have that actual image here. So if you don't, if you want to use a thing or like a project, like a video like these in different projects, um, you have to sort of like always have to find that media file and then always upload it into here and then copying and making sure that it's always there, right? So you want to avoid that and the way to avoid that is by using the loader node. So if we go into Fusion right here, so we can see here the loader and this not showing the image that we have here. So if we just grab this loader and find the image here and then replace that then we can do the same and add this composition into any project and it will always use this same pathway to find the image that we need to use and then you don't have to have you don't have to go and find that and drag that media file into your project every time so that is pretty much it i hope that you were able to understand this concept so the one that you should use is the one that will work for you either the media in or the loader the loader probably is better and more helpful to use because it adapts better to many situations i hope that you enjoyed this video and without further ado i just hope to see you in the next episode here in suave bye